Okay, I am done for winter break, except for tomorrow is teacher's records day, so I gotta input grades and I'm gonna level all my books because I've gotten a lot more, um, et cetera. So, but right now I'm going to the store because I need to um, get something for a party I'm going to now, which is a staff holiday party at one of the um, one of my fellow teachers' houses. So I'm excited for that, and I'm just excited to unwind and relax. Yay! Also, it was pajama day today, and I, I wore yoga pants because I was like, I always feel awkward in like thin pajama pants at school, but um, but I got my comfy hoodie on, so that's pretty awesome. It was an awesome comfy day. Good morrow. Today is Friday, and it's a teacher work day, so I'm headed to work a little lighter than usual this morning because it's a little later because we don't I think we don't need to be there till 8 anyway I actually might be late I'm trying this is a weird morning anyway um, but the staff party was really fun last night and I know that we'll have a bunch of the leftovers from that party here today and from what I heard our principal is going to be providing breakfast this morning, so I'm quite excited and starving. <laughs> Tyler was like, let me make you eggs. I'm like, no, no, no. <laughs> There's going to be a breakfast. Don't, don't you waste your eggs on this. Save them for tomorrow morning. <laughs> but tonight, we're going to have my parents over to give them their Christmas gifts and um, make some dinner for them, etc. So I'm excited to see them over at our place, and that's going to be nice. And Pinocchio can see him a little bit because he's going to be staying with them while we're in London. So just getting used to them more and more. <laughs> oh, I'm gonna miss Pinocchio. Also, look at this awesome shirt. I bought it in Epcot <laughs> at the Mexico Pavilion there. And I remember posting on Instagram back when I bought it this past summer saying, should I buy it? Cause I was torn cause it's a kid's shirt. And so I was like, I don't know, it might fit weird. And it doesn't fit perfectly. That is for darn sure. But it was totally worth it. And I'm really glad that I bought it. Anywho, but it stunk because when I posted that I remember I was like I don't know we left and we went around like on the other side of Epcot and then when I decided I wanted to buy it we had to leave for like a reservation we had so we had to run all the way back buy it and then go and it was hot anyway <laughs> weird what you remember isn't it also some early morning thoughts my friend Lisa who I work with sent me or gave me as a Christmas gift this book of daily devotions and I know not everyone that watches me is religious or Christian but what I loved the message in yesterday's it was, it was talking about feeling empty and like feeling like you have a void in your life and not knowing what that is and um, I've certainly felt that way in the past and um, I think we all feel that way from time to time but it was just talking about how God can fill that void and you know when you reach out to him and you pray to him and ask him for help throughout the day you might not realize it but by the end of the day you're gonna realize that God has filled that void and you're gonna feel that throughout the day you didn't realize you were feeling less and less empty but by the end of the day when you're laying down to bed you'll realize that wow I do feel fulfilled and I don't feel alone and I don't you know and it, I just I loved that thought that throughout the day you're not going to realize it but God is filling you up with happiness and with um, fullness and I don't know that's just been stuck in my head and I was telling Lisa about that the other day and she was just like yes like it's so true and on those days that I'm feeling so either just crummy because it was a bad day but not really for any particular reason and there's no reason for me to be upset or sad and when I do reach out to God and just pray, I always feel better. And not necessarily instantly better, but just by the end of the day, I'm like, oh wow, my day really turned around. I wonder why that is. And I remember, oh yeah, probably because I reached out to God. So even if you're not religious, I feel like you can still take something away from that. Like, you know, whatever higher power you believe in or, you know, whatever you just put your faith in, reaching out to that, I think can really make a difference, even if it's not immediate. That's all. My wisdom for the day. My Friday wisdom. <laughs> Struggle. You got, how much did you... All right. There's that sun again. Um, so excited. I'm, of course, bringing some work home, but grades are in. Blah, 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 all that stuff's done. I just need to get some plans together. That way, when I come back in two weeks, I'm good to go. I have, like, half my plans done, which is stressing me out because usually I have all my plans done by, like, Thursday for the next week, but... Not this time, folks. So that is that. Anyway, so I've got to go home and in about three hours, a little less than three hours, my parents are going to come over, so we, I need to make sure we've got everything we need, and hopefully I don't need to go to the store. I go to the store every day. It's crazy, I know. 
but anywho, that's all. So I am taking like a 20 minute nap or trying to. And he has been sitting like this for like 10 minutes. Staring. I think he's waiting on daddy. Hi, puppy dog. <laughs> Alright, that's enough kisses. That's enough kisses for one afternoon. I think you're the reason I keep waking out. I think it's your kisses. Mm. I can't sleep with him all over me. He literally keeps standing on my ow on my head. No Kyo. He has brought me every toy. <laughs> he has brought me like five toys. Leave me alone, dog. <laughs> They're my wispies again. They can't hide. They don't lie. They're lion wisps. Yeah. When I was in kindergarten, I told Tyler, well, Tyler knows. I've even told my students, when I was in kindergarten, everyone called me lion because my hair, like, from every angle would stick out. I looked awesome as a lion. Every once in a while, we'll get hey. this. Hey, get out no. of there. So we've got our gifts for my... Okay. Hi. Oh, right in the teeth. Pow, right in the kisser. Pow, right in the kisser. So we've got our gifts for my parents under there. Tyler's got gifts wrapped for me. i got to wrap his gifts tomorrow because we're doing... Except oh, your big gift. Because... <laughs> I'm like, it's just a waste of wrapping paper. So I'm like, I'm sorry your big gift is not wrapped. <laughs> I don't mind. It is a waste. We're really weird and picky about our wrapping paper. <laughs> two. We have two. Two rolls. Don't need any more. When we have too many, then no, none of them get used up. So anyway. Um, what get was I talking about? Pinocchio, he loves tissue paper so much. Get out of here. So we're about to um, finish dinner up, and my parents should be here any minute. And well, why am I on here right now? There was something I was going to say. I oh, I was just going to say that tomorrow, or no, Sunday morning, right, Tyler? Mm -hmm. He, Tyler and I are going to do our Christmas because we won't have, like, our Christmas will be with his family in London, and we're not, like, bringing gifts there or anything because we've already done them. So so we're going to wake up Sunday morning and pretend like it's Christmas. It's going to be so nice. Christmas came early this year. <sighs> <sighs> oh. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. <laughs> Happy New Year. Safe travel. I'll just take a bite. I'm watching a lot of Rick Steves. Like yeah, have you show. really? I, I love Rick like Steves too. He's one of my idols. I love Rick Steves. I, lo I just love looking at the places he goes. Oh, I know. I know. Well, you should see some of my new videos I just got done. <laughs> I'll have to show you guys. They're cutely Christmas. wrapped, Mama. European. The Christmas well, this wrapping paper. Oh, oh, I haven't seen that. That's cool. Our Did teacher gave us a like gift like every day, our principal. And, they come down on these and she gave us a roll of no. wrapping paper. Smart so gift. I something to enjoy while you. Something about getting wrapped up in the Christmas season. I guess yeah. have Lime juice, beer. vodka, and ginger beer. Yeah. And these are so Moscow big meals. right now. Yeah. Yeah, these Moscow. I have never seen. We bought that. And I, oh, that's great. What? And after we saw I was bought them, I seen them everywhere. Yeah, we were at TJ Maxx or something one time, and I saw these copper mugs. And I was like, that's kind of interesting. I wonder what that is. Ever since then, I've seen them everywhere. They're it's huge right now. now. Yeah, I've seen them that way. everywhere now. Since we bought them, mm -hmm. I said, yeah, wow. Fonts are beautiful. Can you hold up that? Is and so they lived cute. happily ever after. Oh, get, he's got your Where'd you say you got it? Hey, hey. Made hey. Up. He's running off. Ah, he's got a minefield. There you go. Pinocchio.